Shalom. We're gonna try to uh, make a target individual video. See if they allow me to upload it. If not, I'm just gonna express myself anyway. Just had a thought. Um, I, I made a video, I guess a couple of videos a while back on uh, another YouTube channel um, that, that I created back in the day. And uh, it was basically a what if. And if you hear that in the background, that's just the um, a natural sounds video, you know, for relaxation, of running water, and different things like that. But um, I made a video back in the day called uh, What If, a couple of those. And I got that idea basically from the comic books. Back in the day, you can switch up universes. You can bring Spider-Man, you know, out of the Marvel Universe and let him fight Superman in the DC Universe and different things like that. Now they got all these different universes now. And then they, now they bring them all together. Um, so the thought is, what if in this targeted individual situation? And those who are targeted have a sense of seeing. Like the movie The Sixth Sense. You can see things others can't see. And because of those entities that's in that dimension, know that you can see them and they can see you, but others cannot see it. That's why they feel comfortable interacting with you because others won't believe you. <laughs> what if? Um... What if we had our what what if we had crossed over and we didn't know it? Kind of like those, those movies where the spirits live in the house with with the families in the house, but they think the family is invading they promise. <laughs> I'm just saying, what if? And then, what if all those beings that you see around you who look like people you knew are actually uh, angelic host, demonic legions, and different things like that? And they know that you don't really know what's going on, so that's why everybody is always smiling around you and they look at, it, look at each other like he had no idea what's going on. What if? And then I was thinking how I had made a video before that people that had passed on, like for instance, one of my favorite football players was Walter Payton. Every now and then I would go back and watch some sweetness highlights. At one time I went back to I think the year of 1984, according to the. Uh, Roman ca calendar, I believe it is, time. And uh, I actually watched Sweetness play a whole game from 1984. I went back to the future. Brought, brought, brought Sweetness back alive. Sweetness was walking around, moving, having his beam, high stepping, high fiving. I went back in time and, and resurrected sweetness. What if? So then yesterday I was sitting here, and then all you know, all of a sudden this uh, black cat popped up out of nowhere, like you know, like it does, you know, out of either that CERN machine or whatever's going on. I don't know. But um, this black cat popped up out of nowhere. And I'm sitting in my house, and it's outside, but it looks straight at me like it saw me. How do you see me from out there? But then I told him, I said, I see you too. And it had to look at his eyes, wide open eyes. Look. I said, if you're evil, get off my property. And I, I pointed like this, and it got off the property, so it must have been evil. 
Man, what if? This is really... Uh, what's his name? Steve Arrington had a song one time called Way Out. It's a, oh, oh, oh. And it goes... Man, you go way out. We'll take you way out. This is way out. <laughs> Well, you know, just in case you, in case some can't understand, this is just a what if scenario. You know, so you okay listen to it. It's just what if. Okay then. And shalom unto you.